10 sixes, 7 fours, 215 strike rate, 129 from only 60 delivery. Highest individual innings for IPL 2023 edition. Top most runs gaining batsman of the season. Three centuries in four games. Shubham Gill, what an IPL season he is passing through. With his batting, impress everyone. Here is the orange cap winner, centurion player of the match, Shubham Gill post-match presentation speech. Ah, Shubman, where do I start after an innings like that? Your captain said it's one of the finest he has seen. All the people in the commentary box said it was one of the best IPL innings in the last 15 years. At what point do you think in an innings, it's going to be my day? Is there a shot that you play that gives you that impression, my day today? Uh, not really. For me, it's all about, you know, playing ball to ball, assessing the situation, playing over to over. There was maybe, maybe that over... Uh, in which I had three sixes. That's when I'm, that's when I got the momentum. Really, I can go big. Uh, that's when I realized, okay, maybe you know this is my day, and I have to make it big again. And we need a big total on this wicket because it was a really good wicket to bat on. The big difference in your game this year is the number of sixes you're hitting. I was just looking up some numbers. You're hitting a six every 33 balls. Now you're hitting a six every 16 balls. Was that a conscious decision that I must be a six hitting batter? Not really a conscious uh, decision. Uh, obviously, you keep practicing, you keep uh, wanna grow, you keep wanna evolve as a as a player, as a cricketer, as a batsman. Uh, but I feel the the belief is more important, and uh, that's that's what I've had this this year and last year as well. And obviously, it helps you know when you are coming from from a good uh, international season when you've had runs runs under you. And with me, I know it's it's always about starting once I know once I start i can keep going hardik pandya said it in our commentary box matthew hayden and kevin peterson said it too it's about your decision making that is what they thought is that what has changed in 23 because 2023 has been an absolute dream year for you uh, i feel it's been a combination of a lot of things uh, you know i think last year from that west indies tour uh, that's when you know i Shifted a gear and I got injured in, in 2021 leading up to the IPL and I was out for about a couple of months and that's when uh, I started really, I always worked on my game but that's when I started realizing you know what are the areas that, that I need to work on and I made some, I made some technical changes in, in my batting leading up to the, this tournament but in December, around December, uh, that's when I made the technical changes when uh, I was called up for the New Zealand series just after the T20 World Cup. Expectations now follow you everywhere you go. How do you keep expectations away when you're going out to bat? Expectations and all of these stuff are, you know, are a factor when you are outside the rope. Once you step in, it's all about how you can contribute and it's all about how you can uh, give, give you 100% how you can maintain that intent, intent, uh, intensity throughout. On a slightly lighter note, you said to me in the mid-innings that you weren't expecting to wear the cap because you were setting your hair. Do you always do that after you get a hundred? Uh, I wipe the, I'd say I'd wipe the sweat on my forehead, not setting my hair. <laughs> okay, there you go. You, because the way you're batting, you'll have to do it very often. That was, that was a breathtaking display. Is that the best you've played, you think, this year? Probably, yeah. This is, this is my best inning so far in IPL. Don't say it's the best because we're looking forward to another one from you. For sure. Well done and keep that form alive till the 7th of June. Thank you.